Hey, how's it going, guys? Oblivion back for another video about Final Fantasy 15. Well, I guess I haven't made one about Final Fantasy 15, but I'm back with another video. Today, I'd like to talk about Final Fantasy 15, guys. Yes, there's other games I like other than Dragon Ball. It might be hard to believe, but I do. I like other games. Anyway, today I'm going to be talking about the different editions and basically the old, the overall production that they've done for Final Fantasy 15. Can you think about it, guys? Literally, this game took almost 10 years of development. Or so-called development. I don't think they were focusing on it fully during all that time, but they had some development for it the whole time. Anyway, some bonuses you get for this game before it comes out. Obviously, we have the five anime episodes, basically leading up to what the game will be. We have the Kingsglaive um, whole-length movie. It's basically the game's CGI kind of cutscene graphics, this and that. You get what I'm saying, guys. You've seen those long cutscenes. Basically, it's an entire movie based on just those cutscenes, those models for the M game cutscenes. Basically, they're just going to use those characters and make a whole length movie. Pretty crazy. The guy that plays Jesse on Breaking Bad, he actually does one of the voices. That's one of the bigger actors I can think of right now. They had other ones. Obviously, the Japanese dub. Or I guess it's not really a dub, but the Japanese version, the original version. I'm not sure about the actors at all either. Anyway, you can get the King's Glaive along with some of the other Final Fantasy versions. So, that's pretty cool to think of, guys. Another thing is the mobile app. I don't know when the mobile app comes out yet. I'm not sure when, but there is a mobile app that eventually this game will get. So, we get a mobile app, a movie, five anime episodes, tons of behind the scenes footage. I just check out the channel, guys, Final Fantasy 15. They have so much stuff on it, a lot of cool crap. Um, the deluxe edition for this game is $90. If you get it, I think it's well worth your money for all the exclusives you get. But the deluxe, the, uh, sorry guys, the deluxe edition includes a steel book case with unique art. It's not just the actual standard game case with, you know, just a steel book. I know some games do that, and you, let me tell you something. That is the worst thing you can do. Get some cool art on your steel book cases. Come on. The steelbook cases, unique art, stuff like that. The deluxe edition also comes with the King's Glaive movie. Um, <laughs> due to copyright, I have no idea if I could show this. I probably won't. If I can, if there's no rights to being able to maybe live stream or something, I have no clue. It sounds kind of sketchy. Maybe I won't do it. I don't know. And then the standard game itself. And then you get some other things as well. You get some skins, you get some outfits, some... Um, um, car skins as well, you get different car skins, so that shows us there that the car can be customized, our characters can be customized, and we can have customized different weapons, which is kind of cool, I'm wondering what else we can get within the game, I'm sure there's going to be tons and tons of things we can get as well, but anyway, another note, the movie is actually a Blu-ray, so if you get the game you know, on PS4, you know, PS4 already is a Blu-ray player, except for PS4 Pro, why? I don't even know if the Slim can do Blu-ray either, but the PS4 Pro guys, nope, no Blu-ray player there. Get your Xbox for that one. God, the, yeah, the Xbox, the new Xbox has Blu-ray. Like, Sony invented the Blu-ray technology, yet somehow they're not going to include that within, I'm so disappointed in you, PlayStation, why would you do this to us? Anyway, if you have the older versions, or the, you know, first release versions of the PS4, that has Blu-ray already in it. You don't have to worry about that, guys. You automatically are able to <laughs> watch the movie. It's a Blu-ray disc, or it says Blu-ray disc here. From what I can see, it, it's Blu-ray. I don't know what to say, guys, but anyway, the movie's Blu-ray. Get a Blu-ray player, PlayStation before Pro. There you go. You get that. So not too bad with the deluxe edition, guys. Cool steelbook, two discs bunch and bunch of extras and stuff like that uh, definitely a cool thing to go for check out the anime episodes guys a real good way to figure out if you're going to like this franchise go check the anime episodes see if you love the characters first because they're not exactly how they're going to be but basically it shows how all of them become friends kind of and basically the backstory I definitely played this demo right here guys there is a secondary demo that came out but it's a little bit difficult and I'm not sure exactly how to do it I'm sure if I looked online checked a few videos I'm sure I could figure it out really easy but I just don't know how to do it exactly you have to create a Japanese PlayStation account 
and then you can go to the store and you can download a Final Fantasy 15 demo. Basically, Final Fantasy 15 is split into chapters, and you can play the entire first chapter, guys. Yes, the entire first chapter, um, just from this demo, but it's only Japanese. So if you do end up getting a Japanese account and doing all that stuff, only the main menu is in English. So, ugh, that's kind of frustrating, but if you're really willing to go with it, you can do it. I think you could turn in, I don't know if there's even subtitles, because I don't even think they subtitled it. It was only meant to be released in Japan. I don't know why they did that to us. Maybe there wasn't dialogue for it yet or something. I have no clue why they didn't release it um, in English either. Maybe they just say, hey, we're just going to release it real quick in Japan. Maybe it was just too much for it to be released in English, but I'm pretty sure that it, this is going to be the very last demo, or the very last bit of gameplay we're going to be getting for Final Fantasy XV until the release of the game, guys, because I don't think they'd do anything else before the game came out. Maybe they've released the demo in English. And if they do, I'm sure to do some videos on that, but maybe they're releasing it in English first before the actual game comes out. But yeah, guys, definitely check out the anime episodes. Play the demos, guys. There is an old Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy Zero has a demo, but I don't think you'd want to buy an entire game for just a small demo of Final Fantasy 15. That's kind of dumb, but if you have that, please, guys, check out all the demos and stuff like that. <clears throat> this demo right here can be played in any any nationality or whatever. It's it's in English too, guys. Just look up Final Fantasy 15 demo. You can find this in the store. Check all this stuff out, guys, because this game's coming out the 29th of this month. It, it really doesn't have that much longer to go, but that's basically all I have to say, guys. If you want more Final Fantasy content, please like this video or give me a comment. Tell me what you guys feel and think about Final Fantasy 15. Maybe it's mechanics and weapons and stuff like that. There's a lot of stuff to talk about here, guys. I don't know. This game seems very, very good. I'm finding it very hard to not like this game, and it's... You know, you're able to have cars that go into autoplane, and you're able to fly cars, you're able to go on boats, and the immersiveness, you're able to go into stores and play arcade games and have your car fixed. Just, ugh, so much depth to this, and your combat, and ugh. There's so much to it, guys, but, ugh. Tell me what you guys think about this game. It's gonna be a big one. It really is. I definitely think it'll be big. Up there with Kingdom Hearts this year, you know? I guess not this year, I guess next year, but this year we got this game, so this game will hold me off until Kingdom Hearts 2.8, probably, even further, I'd, I'd imagine, and then even further on, but that's about all I have to say with this game, guys, please, if you like my Final Fantasy 15 content, show me a like, show me a bit of love, comment what you guys think, and subscribe if you haven't been subscribed yet, if you want more content from me, you want to know when I make a new video? You can subscribe. I do a lot of Dragon Ball stuff as well. This is just a little Final Fantasy 15 video. I like Final Fantasy and Dragon Ball. I think that's what I'm going to have my channel be mostly about. I might do a few videos here and there about some different things, but that's basically what I'm going to do. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Thank you. Oh yeah, I forgot to say. <laughs> I have some just random gameplay of Final Fantasy 15 demo. If you care to watch this part, watch this part. If you don't, just click away, guys. But I thought I'd show off the game before the release. Get some people hyped about this game. Just gonna have some gameplay going on here, guys. But that's all I gotta say.